actually I started with my first year in my, uh, my college. Uh, um, I was a student in uh, uh, economics and political science uh, uh, college. And in my first year, I met one of the civil society activists, and he was one of my board in one of the activities inside the university. And we started in this year, it was 2005, and we have a big kind of uh, political reform in Egypt. There were a new presidential elections, and there were new, new amend amendment for the constitution. And we have a lot of discussions about what's happening, how we are going to tackle it, how to go and participate in the society. So I started talking with him, and this was my first beginning to work in the human rights field. I started to work in the in this organization that I have been working to since 2005 till now. And I started with the media monitoring for the presidential elections. And after that, I completed with human rights education and uh, working on raising awareness for youth, especially in my age, with democracy and election issues, and uh, also issues concern freedom, dignity, and the uh, universalism of freedom and the universalism of human rights. Actually, we are uh, a, uh, a special kind of NGOs, which is not uh, directly connected to the Ministry uh, of the uh, Social Solidarity. We are uh, registered as a civil company, and this is because we didn't want to, be, to have this kind of restrictions, to have kind of pressure from the government, or that anyone can affect our uh, observation or our work in the human rights and the civil society field. So when we started, we worked on the media monitoring, we worked, worked in the human rights education, and we sometimes we got some kind of, I will not say restrictions, but I will say kind of annoyment. And they were trying to ask several times, about, what are you doing and why you are doing that? And we were very transparent, <laughs> and even one of the in one of the days and one of the trainings, one of the uh, people that I was trained, uh, he asked me, why you are doing that? I told him, because we want to get the regime down. And it was a very small statement, and I didn't mean it in this time, but now we got the regime down. <laughs> the main focus for our organization is the youth, especially the age from uh, 17 till 35. Working with this specific uh, target group because our society and our population is this kind of population which you can call it a youth population. We are a youth society because the majority of our population are from youth. So if you are going to lead the country to any place, if you want to make a change, you have to work with youth. And I do believe that the you, you as youth, we as youth in this uh, in this country. We have the power of changes and we are believing in our ideas, we are believing in our country, in our history. So we have this kind of dignity, we can go and do it, we can do anything and we, we are not believing in any obstacles or barriers, I don't think so.